better shot from Grosseal that we got in on storm pins. Great day out on the island, and uh, I agree. Uh, we've gotten a lot of pictures of some of the uh, gorgeous weather out there. High pressure and control today. It does start sliding to the east, so that's going to allow those clouds to get a little bit thicker by tomorrow. 8 p.m., 9 p.m., we'll start seeing showers develop, and they will become more widespread in the overnight hours going into early Thursday. We may get a little bit of a break on Thursday morning, but once we get into the second half of Thursday, on the back side of that low, we're going to get even more rain, and that is also going to add to those totals. Finally shutting the faucets off there on Thursday evening, probably around sunset or a little bit before. Then we've got higher pressure coming in for Friday, which doesn't look all that bad either. Saturday and Sunday are a different story entirely, and we'll discuss that here in a second. But here are the rainfall totals just for Wednesday night into Thursday, and the model has got at least some one and one and a half inch totals here on the east side. Notice that those numbers get a little bit higher out here in southern Ontario, so it really does depend on the track of that low who gets the higher totals. There is going to be quite a bit of moisture within this system, so no doubt somebody's going to get soaked. Uh, the question is just who 57 is the low tonight and the high clouds are going to start coming in, but still tomorrow fairly nice day, but just when you compare it to today, we'll just have to knock it down a notch. 75 is what we're expecting for a high in the city, 77 out at the airport. So again, the temperatures are going to be identical. We're just trading in a little bit of the sunshine for thicker clouds in the afternoon. A little bit of a southeast wind tomorrow, keeping uh, temperatures towards the lake in the 60s, at least in Monroe County. Inland areas, all 70s, mid 70s out there in the west zone and north zone. You're going to have a little bit of a lake cooling effect there uh, with Lexington checking in at 68 and the rest of us in the mid 70s. So here is your seven day forecast and again Friday looks fantastic too. 75 mostly sunny temperatures still in the mid to upper 70s over the weekend. Neither one of those days are washouts. It looks like most of that rain is going to be late Saturday.